I feel like I always wear the same shirt when I film. <laughs> hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Kat. If you didn't know that, now you know that. Today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you guys my skincare routine. Um, now, I don't do a ton of things just because I feel like it's not good to put too many products on your face. So I don't do a lot for my skincare routine, but I still, you know, obviously put stuff on it occasionally. <laughs> so I'm just going to be showing you guys the products I use and how often I use them, that sort of thing. Just my whole regimen. So if you want to see that, just keep watching. Okay, so to start off, I'm going to show you guys the lotion that I use every day for my face, and it's just the Cetaphil Moisturizing Lotion. I think there's also a version of this that's like just for the face, because this one says body and face, but I like to use this one, I guess. I just, I've always had this one, and this is kind of what I use on the daily, just to, you know moisturize my face basically and I feel like it works pretty well. I think I was very lucky in the sense that I've never really had like acne problems. I mean occasionally when I would get my period I would sometimes like get a few pimples here and there but nothing like crazy. So I know a lot of people struggle with acne and I think I'm very very blessed to have never had any acne problems so knock on wood that it doesn't happen anytime soon. And yeah, so this is what I use literally every day. Sometimes I'll just use it when I get out of the shower, other times I'll just randomly put it on. Usually I'll only put it on put it on once a day, so that's kind of it for that. And when I take a shower, I usually wash my face with this product right here. I got this from Target and it works really well. It's dermatologist tested, so yeah, this is like very professional stuff because I know, just spilled out a little bit, because um, I know a lot of people use like drugstore stuff and apparently that stuff's not very good for you. So I did a lot of research and tried to find the best um, face wash and this is definitely one of them. So if I were you, I would not trust clean and clear or whatever, is that what it's called, clean and clear? clear and clean, whatever. Those are not the best for you, so I would highly recommend this one if you don't have like a higher quality face wash. This is a really good one. Um, I've had this for, I don't know, like almost a year and look how much is already gone. It comes on this like big thing. I squirt a little bit of this on my hand and I just rub it and rub it on my face. Actually, a lot of people don't know this. You're supposed to rub your face for at least 20 to 30 seconds, so you know, you can't just like, you know, rub it on, screw, winch it off and you're done. Like you have to really rub it in, get it all in there, you know, all around. So yeah, a lot of people don't know that. A lot of people just, you know, plop it on their face and rinse it off like five seconds later. Nope, fun. But yeah, so this is what I use in the shower. And then usually once or twice a week, I will exfoliate my face. I actually recently started using these. I used to use, um, some sort, I don't know, it was some sort of drugstore thing. It worked okay, but it wasn't the best, but these work really good. These are peel pads, exfoliation peel pads. I got them on Amazon. They are from the brand Instaderm, and they're just like these moist pads that you take out and you, your skin has to be dry. So I usually do it like right after, not right after, but a couple minutes after I get out of the shower, and I will use one, take one of these and rub it all on my face, avoiding my eyes and then wait a few minutes before putting on my face lotion, so. Or face moisturizer, I don't know why I worded that weird, but anyway, yeah. So usually this is only a product for like once or twice a week. Sometimes I'll do twice a week, sometimes I'll just do once a week. Just depends on the week, I guess, but that's what I use for that. Exfoliation peel pads, super easy. I wanted something really easy that I wouldn't have to like spend time on, so I thought peel pads were the way to go, and these have been working pretty good, so yeah. And then also, I just wanted to show this, I don't use this every day, but um, this is for when I do my makeup. This is the primer I use, it's also like a moisturizer, it's just the, um, is it Smashbox? Yeah, Smashbox Photo Finish. So yeah, when I do, before I put my makeup on, I will always put this on. So yeah, and that's pretty much it. That's all I really do for my skincare. Not a lot at all. You know, I feel like it's it's not good to put too much on your face. That's all there is to it. I mean, obviously my face isn't perfect, but 
it's, I mean, I don't see any pimples. Do you, I think I actually have one right here, actually. I think because I'm about to start my period, which is really weird how that works. Whenever I am about to start my period, I get pimples. And this time it happens to be right above my lip, so yeah. But that is all I use for my skin here. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to smile and have a great day. Just pull me a little closer Oh me, roll me like a coaster And say, say you'll never let me